Um, can you, um, how is the OpenStreetMap project at this moment uh, going? Really well. Yeah, yeah. That's, um, <laughs> we have nearly 8,000 users. Yeah, and um, we have vast sections of the UK, of the Netherlands here, yeah. um, cities in Germany, Denmark, all over the place being completed. Lots of activity in South Africa, um, bits of Canada, Australia. I mean, as a as a peer-based production open source project, it's going quite well. Are there already businesses running to you uh, asking to cooperate or something? I wouldn't say they're running to me, but I, there are people certainly interested in what's going on. Because uh, yeah. a lot of pe people smell the the coffee beans, they, they see the, weed, the way the uh, wind is blowing, and um, we'd like to be ahead of the curve when we have free map data of vast sections of an actual country. Um, how do you see the, the future of the OpenStreetMap project? Um, do you uh, think there are coming um, multiple purposes for the data? I mean, uh, now it is just, you know, a plain map, but you can do lots of things. Uh, you can combine it with mashups, with other kinds of data. Um, as far as I know, you also do opengeodata.org. Can you tell us uh, something about the future? And, uh Predicting the future is quite hard, yeah. <laughs> but I think that the quality and level of co coverage in OpenStreetMap is going to continue to increase. We're going to get more and more map data and we're going to get more and more people involved. Yeah. Um, and I don't know if we've hit critical mass yet. That'll be a thing in hindsight, and I don't know whether we ever will uh, and what that will quite mean. Um, it's very hard to say where things are going to go. Um, it's a very exciting time to be in the world of maps, I suppose. What is your um, personal motivation to do these open things? For the women, mainly. That's what it is. Really? Or yeah. joking? Um, <laughs> my motivation is to change the world. and. Really You're now doing the photo model, like uh, elite. Uh, sorry, Fo photo models always say that you know, changing the world. But you are serious, or? Well, we are. <laughs> okay. We are releasing a map of the world yeah. for free, right? And it will just be a matter of time before OpenStreetMap or someone else uh, does this. Yeah. Um, I just prefer it to be us. Okay. Um, do you have uh, something to uh, uh, tell or to um, say at the end of this interview? Where is the interview going to be shown? Um, at this moment I don't know where, right. because I still don't have a website or something. Okay. But uh, my uh, purpose is to uh, create lots of interviews with people active in the free and open source software, open content, open standards, open data mm -hmm. world, and uh, to uh, release it under some kind of open content license. I don't really know at this moment which uh, something, but uh, that's, that's uh, the purpose of this interview. Mm -hmm. And I also don't know if I would... Uh, if I would do it like um, streaming or just uh, BitTorrent or something because of because of the bandwidth, you know, when you do it streaming, it costs lots of bandwidth. Um, and I also want people to uh, translate, to produce translation files, so uh, that I don't have to do it. And that's also the. Uh, the, the <laughs> surplus. Let, let, let's interview you. <laughs> uh, okay. So, so what are you it's doing? With it, it? Um, it is also the surplus. Is that the right word? The the positive point of open content licenses is that people can add to it. You know, so uh, people producing translation files can uh, 
can just download the video and when they uh, release their translation files under the same uh, license it, it's no problem and um, so that's what I want to do and um, that's uh, the purpose of it and, uh, cool yeah. oh. and, um, because I'm uh, I'm present at lots of uh, different kind of uh, open source uh, or open content open standards open data uh, meetings and I was thinking how can I uh, add something uh, to it and how can I uh, use uh, those meetings to uh, give people uh, uh, their how, how did the how um, how does what's the name of the guy who uh, said everybody needs 15 minutes of fame or everybody gets 15 minutes of fame you know what I mean uh, in the 60s yeah. Yeah, famous artist. Yeah, who I yeah. Totally forget the name yeah. Of. Um, yeah. You did the Marilyn Monroe's, you yeah. the different colours. Andy Warhol. Yeah, Andy Warhol. Yeah. I want to give uh, different kinds of o the different open source projects or the open projects uh, their 15 minutes of fame. Mm -hmm. um, well, I'm looking for a lot more than 15 minutes. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> I mean. Uh, the, the 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 big problem with open source uh, with open projects in general is uh, lots of creativity, lots of initiatives, lots of this, this, and this. Mm -hmm. But the capital, the the capital to uh, you know the hardware capital, the mm -hmm. money, that, that's always the problem. So, uh, but there aren't enough business people in open source. That's the problem. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But but they are get, they are getting a lot. They are getting more more business. Uh, more business people, I think, because you also see at this moment now Ubuntu is getting more generally accepted. But it was designed to be that way. Debian yeah. was never designed to be that way. Red yeah. Hat messed up that opportunity. Yeah, yeah. You, you are a Debian lover. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, and Ubuntu. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. It's it's very exciting now to see uh, how it, uh, the way it is going now. You know, uh, Dell is starting to sell. Computers uh, with uh, Ubuntu uh, pre. Uh well, they had to. They're just responding to the market. Yeah, yeah, that's true. Yeah, yeah, and but I'm wondering how long, um, how long it will really. T I mean, how long it will really take that that these kind of things are getting big, you know? Because at this moment, it are just it's you know it's a niche. And I think it will take years for really to get. Uh, oh yeah, it will. Yeah, yeah. So. Um, Open has been going three years already. So. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Let's stop this. Uh, yeah.